qualified in engineering, yeah. you're 50 years old now. Tell us a little bit about the background and the investment that you have here. Background, well, Tridam actually was brought into fruition to deal with the local engineering economies like the Paxmans, Vacumatics of the world. Uh, about 10 years ago, we went down the aerospace route and since then we've grown considerably, massive investment. You're probably looking at about three, nearly three million pound over the last two or three years in investment. I see that you invest heavily with uh, Manzac machines with five axes and also lays. Also, you've got a, a new siding head from Star. So, so I can see the investment here, but what type of work are you really after? It's mainly the aerospace work that we, 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 we are good at the aerospace work. That's where we excel, castings, anything, raw billets. Yeah, we can do the whole lot, really. Uh, and today, uh, Renishaw PLC have asked us to come in to talk to you about how they've helped you in reference to your needs with the metrology. But what's the integration? Where, where have you actually worked with Renishaw? The beauty with Renishaw is we, we buy it on our machines as part of the uh, turnkey solution. It gives us the reassurance that what we're making is, good, is, is correct. It gives our customers the reassurance that they're getting the correct quality. Because I suppose the demand from the aerospace sector specifically, you know, it's very high tolerance, isn't it? Yes, yeah, very high tolerance. We could be working down to three decimal places, my, uh, millimetres, so yeah, micron t tolerances. And, and I think initially, uh, as I understand from Renishaw, it, it's that they've really helped you uh, with, with a certain customer in the motorsport sector, Ricardo, yeah. uh, you know, wins some business. Tell us how that actually, and that process actually worked, Paul. Uh, we had uh, a, a diff case to machine for Ricardo. Uh, they were really up against it and they wanted us to turn it around. The thing is, we had 11 days. Uh, without the Renishaw probing system, we would never have been able to get anywhere near that. It just aided us with the setup, the inspection. We, we just couldn't have done it without it. So when you went to Renishaw and said, look, you know, we've got this uh, specific job, you know, what can you offer us? How can you help? What was the process? The process was we, we already had the, the probing on the machine. They really gave us the backup on how to get the best out of it. And, and specifically the, the job that you're doing on this Mazak at the moment, you know, how, how does it actually integrate with this type of work with the aerospace customer? Well, the, the part we're doing at the present moment in time is for one of our aerospace customers. Um, this used to be done on one of our three-axis machines over multiple operations. Because we're now doing it on the five-axis and with the Renishaw program, probing, we can run this 24-7 and we know we're getting correct parts off. And I see that it's all automated. Is that part of the process as well? Yeah, automation's definitely the way to go forward nowadays. So how many hours are you actually working on, you know, man hours are you working on this machine with this system now? Man hours, we booked two and a half hours to it last month, but we actually got over 500 hours worth of production. So and without the Renishaw probing system, we couldn't get that guarantee of quality. And when, when you've looked at the process of working with Renishaw, what, what sort of training and backup have they actually offered you? Training, well, they've come in with the new machines, backup, we've never needed it. Is that because they're that good? Yeah, it just don't break down. And, and when you're looking at the type of work, you say you're, grow, you're growing in the aerospace sector, do you see that Redshaw are going to be a key partner to new investments and machines and, and anything else on the shop floor? Yes, it's definitely going that way. The more automated you get, the more you need the backup systems like the Renishaws to make sure you keep your quality. Now, I know you've got another inspection room here, but the type of work that you've won through motorsport and aerospace, would you have won it without Renishaw? No, because we use the Renishaw in our inspection area as well, so we can guarantee that from the machine to the customer, we're checking it with the same systems. And, and like, like I say, just looking at this job, how many operations are you, are you working on with that uh, component that you got in your hand? That's two operations. Uh, we basically do eight components every 24 hours, but the machine doesn't stop. So when you sum up working with Renishaw, what would, what would you communicate to the market? It works. That's all I can say. It just works. Uh, they're easy to deal with, but we've never had to call them in.